having an outlet is really helpful. Okay, I've made right. so many of these different movies already, but basically just wanted to share. It's totally made my car experience that much better by installing this Apple TV right there in my car. Um, the way you can do it, I'll link all the items below, but basically you just need a special harness that goes to the back of the radio, which will then in turn give you um, the uh, yellow, red, and white input to the screen, like these. And then you would get an HDMI converter to go to the back of the Apple TV, and you would need a um, any type of uh, DC to AC um, converter to power up your, your Apple TV any way you want to do it. I actually just have this tied right into the, the power leads going to the cigarette lighter. No problem there. And then you do have to, you know, drill a little bit hole back there and um, to get the cables and stuff fired up. But I mean, it's it's cool. So basically, if you go to your radio and this, this AV button right here, it's going to be grayed out like these until you get that cable. And it's pretty self-explanatory. It's basically like a piggyback cable. Everything still works. You get a phone call. It interrupts the signal. I mean, it's just, it's really, it's really cool. It works out great. Um, I did try other, other, um, other sources of video instead of the Apple TV. I got one of those, like kind of like a Chromecast, but like the generic one off Amazon. And the picture was just tiny. Didn't know how to scale. So I really am only recommending using the Apple TV right now because it scales perfect. You know, you can um, you can go here, screen format, they have normal. So this is what normal looks like. It doesn't look as good. I think I like um, stretched. Stretch seems to be the best. And I mean, I just have it tied to my uh, mobile hotspot on my phone. This is Apple TV, so you do have to have this door down here open to get the uh, IR signal out because uh, it won't it won't work through here. Um, but I like it like that; it's nice and clean. So if you, you know, with the Apple TV, you go back, you're able to get you know all these other sources. If you subscribe to these things, like I really don't, um, then it'll be that much better for you. But if you got any uh, questions or whatever, uh, let me know. This is in a 2015 Camry uh, SE with just the basic radio. If you look right here, this is your radio number um, right there. It's the uh, Entune, like a uh, basic version. One thing that I also noticed that was kind of a cool, because I always knew that I was going to use it for my phone, um, just to get Wi-Fi off my phone, but the Apple TV has such good um, signal strength that you can go, you know, you pull up to the parking lot at a Starbucks, if you're near a McDonald's, and you search, I mean, you can just connect to Wi-Fi everywhere. So it's just kind of cool to have. Haven't had any problems with T-Mobile throttling me. You know, I just have the basic, you know, like probably like seven gigs of a uh, hotspot, and it's more than enough. So, so this is how all these other apps are working. So if you got any other questions, uh, let me know and I'll talk to you later.